Okay. <coughs> Just going to remove this. And pour myself a bit of iced tea. Just going to remove something there. Okay. Right. Okay. So we've got a raccoon, dire wolf pup, and the coyote. But this really requires us to kill three squirrels. And the wolf to actually get to dig up one bone. Just bless him. I mean, this would be a bone deck. Personally, I'm not a fan of bone decks, but... Cards in starting deck have the annoying sigil. 10 challenge points. Okay. We got cards and again more expensive pelts. Okay, so we've got one life. We've got the additional cards played against us. We've got the annoying sigil on our cards. We've got really regular cards as rewards for the beating bosses and we've got more expensive pelts. Hmm. And we are playing with a deck. A bone deck. Okay. Let's see. Um, I wanted to see if there was something different about the room. Yeah, we can listen to this music. Okay. Have you brought me fine pelts? Well, it depends what you've given me. Hair pelts. The cuckoo and... The ring worm, if I sacrifice it and place it on the cuckoo. These are exquisite, my thanks. <coughs> so, yeah, we get rid of the ring worm straight away, if possible. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight. Though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened the greeting. Why make it you by the fire and had power, said one. And if it doesn't kill it, it's just going to give us 
a cheap card that deals two damage, so it's going to be a good one. Surely a creature could become more powerful, but you would need to risk another moment by the fire. Okay. The survivors were right about the flames. They enhanced the creature's power. Spotting a few of the survivors drooling, you made a hasty retreat with your ringworm. It's too bad they don't allow you to buff him further, like in the main game. <coughs> and we can still buff it even further, or we could sacrifice, let's say, the cuckoo onto the ringworm. Let's see. Good. It's alright, I can't take the hit, then it's going to kill it next turn. Yep, now it's going to kill it. Nope. Okay, so we can sacrifice something. Placing the cuckoo on the ringworm sounds good. Or I could just save them and try to get rid of those because they've got the annoying sigil. I have nowhere really to get rid of them. I could buff even more the ringworm. Hello there, Camille King. How are you doing today? So, now that you're here, I can let you make the choices. So, we got a new deck the, na the last time. It gives us the raccoon, which... Uh, Gives us a bone for each creatures that it kills. The die wolf and the coyote. But there's also the annoying sigil that we unlocked uh, from the challenge that our starting deck starts with this that gives one point of power to the opposing card. So we should think about trying to get rid of those at some point, or just play them when they can kill uh, the cards quickly. So I'm going to leave you... Okay, the flames. I have the most exquisite belts. Okay. Take one. Well, I can only take the free one. Much appreciated. Okay. Warmer kitchen by the fire enhance its health and that hungry survivor. So we can enhance the ringworm. But it's going to it's kind of becoming a good card. 
Are we going to sacrifice the ring worm or are we going to buff it? Yep. But are we going to risk sacrificing it already because it's a cheap card that deals 2 damage or we could just buff it safely once? Two times. Surely your creature could become more powerful. But you would need to risk another moment by the fire. And it's gone. Before you could stop them, one of the survivors seized the ringworm and began tearing at its flesh. The other survivors followed the example and began devouring your creature alive. Fearing for your own life, you retreated. Well, we lost a potentially good card, but... Maybe in the long run, it will benefit us. Because the last time, I was able to... Yes, I know. I'm just saying that the last time yesterday, uh, I was able to get rid of one ringworm early, but they didn't give me many fires after this. So it depends what the game feels like giving us. Okay, so I'm thinking I'm going to allow this bee to strike me for one. And then I'm going to play the raccoon that will kill it. Because if I play the raccoon right there, it's going to buff the bee. Strike me for two instead of one. So I'm just going to place the squirrel right there for the moment. Or we could place the cuckoo right now and maybe stop this bee from joining the fight. Okay, good. Not so good. Now we can kill it. Get your paws off my creature's bones. No. They're mine now. Too bad I don't have enough to place the coyote. Oh, the frog's going to be... Well, it's not going to matter. Yes, it's going to kill it, so I should survive the hit. Yeah, and Coyote is going to be killed by the bullfrog, so just get rid of the, the, the bees. Okay. Okay, left or right, we could get a pack rat already. We could go to the left and get the pack rat, or we could go to the right, then to the left to get the pack rat. Right and left. Okay. We got the mud turtle. The wild bull, the reverse sniper. We could go for the clover. F 
four. For uh, on the clover, I'm assuming your meaning. The thieving raccoon. It gathers the bones of my creatures for you. Yeah. I guess you were talking about the clover when we when you said four. Personally, I would go for the warren. Give us a rabbit. We could place it on the cuckoo. That'd be nice. Or we could go for a mud turtle and give us a shield. Warren onto raccoon. All full, but. A pack rat, always useful, okay. But yeah, the raccoons got the annoying singer. At least once we succeed with this uh, challenge, we can just get past it and take another, because this sucks. If they've got flying things in front of them it's going to be an annoyance Warren onto Kaku and Rat onto Coyote mm. Yeah, sounds good. Um, I could just pick up a squirrel right now, place the pack rat, it will survive the hit from the... Like I said, right now, place it there, okay. It's going to kill the, the ant, so good. Okay, we could pick the cuckoo. The cuckoo would stop the ant. They would only deal two damage. Oh. Never get there in time. Thank you. Okay. Oh, a cockroach. So yeah, this is going to be a bone deck. So 
so I'm thinking the cockroach will be... Okay, you wanted to place the warren onto the cuckoo. Yep, sounds good. And uh, the pack rat onto the coyote. The decrepit wood carver appeared before you. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Oh, something that leaves a tail behind. So maybe something that we could sacrifice or just block the attacks. The grey-haired woman silently collected our carvings and left. Okay. You beheld an immense man slouched beside a murky pond. He appeared to be tearing hunks of flesh from a fish corpse. Some chunks were thrown back into the pond, where a few ghoulish birds snapped them up, and some were sloppily pushed into the hawking man's mouth. You bring fresh fish, easy choose. Okay. Well, we've got the cuckoo to stop you. Okay. And, um, yeah. The cuckoo is going to stay there. Because I want to be able to not hit the pocket, if possible. I'm thinking... Take this. Go fish, okay. Um, it strikes the buckets once. The sharks appear, it strikes the shark. Mm, no. We get rid of the die wolf. Wow, a rabbit pet, oh, very useful. But we still won. First boss down. Okay. We could go for the adder to kill something instantly. We could go for the bullfrog. I'm not a big fan of the kingfisher, but the choice is yours. Two. Ooh. 
will need another map. The sun rose over the sleepy firs. Bird fluttered across the path of wolves and elk. You were embarking upon the woodlands. Okay. Hmm. Knowing you, you would take the, the alpha, right? Yep. Let's see. We could place the cockroach on the pack rat, you know. We could keep getting uh, items. And I see the goo on the left. Goat and put the pack rat on the cockroach. Yeah. And like I said, we've got the goo on the left. Okay. The cuckoo would stop the coyote, hopefully without... Ah. Well, we've got the raven egg. The rabbit would stop the porcupine and give us a bone. Or I could simple, yeah. No, I could get things to kill the porcupine. So. I deal one damage, he deals one damage. No, they deal three damage because of the raven. Yuck. Oh, good. Hmm. The pack rat. Okay, so the pack rat. The black goat or the hook. The hook would pull the porcupine on my side. Place the pack rat right there, which can deal a couple of damage. Ah, that's good. Almost enough bones to place the alpha somewhere. Okay, so if I place the squirrel there, for example, would deal two, three damage against me after I dealt three damage. So, alright, and I get more bones to place the alpha. Hmm. 
So it's going to kill them both. It's going to. Okay. Okay, so it deals 2-3 damage, and then it deals, hmm, or can pull one tooth, and I get the win. Let's not overcomplicate things, like I said. Alright. I'll be waiting here. So, if I remember correctly, cockroach on the pack rat after this. But is there some place to sacrifice? Ah, oh, welcome back! So yeah, we've got the goo on the left. Have you brought me fine pelts? No. Uh, yes, one. Hell pelt. Oh, we've got another cuckoo. Yep. So I meant right onto the cockroach. Yes, I, I got that. But now we've got the choice to make. We could get another cuckoo, which is useful when we want to stop the barrage of cards. Unless they place uh, Well, I've got only one hair pelt. So I'm going for the cuckoo. And again, there's no wyvern. It's a Wolverine! You could say uh, the teeth or... <laughs> These are exquisite, my tanks. I mean, like I said, uh, the the Wyverns are... Drakes or... Oh no. Let me paint for you. I will make... I will aim. I will aim for perfection. So, we could paint this one again. Yep. Mm, yes. Let's see what I can do. I mean, it's a simple card. Ah, you did it right. 
You did it all right. And we've got them twice. Good. And yeah, I don't care. The rabbit's not going anywhere either. <laughs> and we get the rabbit every time. Good. I don't care if the porcupine hits the rocks. I mean, another cuckoo. I could place a cuckoo, yes. Another damage. I like the cuckoo, I really do. I think the cuckoo has become one of my favorite cards. You won't find better paths within a hundred miles. Okay. Take one. Two, four, six, eight. I can. Well, there's a nine. Not enough of that one. So, two cars of those. Thanks for your patronage. Okay, now we can get three cards. It should have been in the original game. Yeah. But didn't you say that people murdered the game? So, maybe people added the new cards from the mod on the game? That'd be nice. That'd be super nice. Ah, uh, yep. I like the cuckoo. You're not going anywhere, mister. Don't... Oh, rabbit pelt. Well, it's going to give me a bone. Next, the raccoon should kill it. Oh. So you're dead, but that one's going to kill the raccoon. It's alright, the coyote will take care of the elk farm next. Oh, another cuckoo! So he's going to hurt one behind okay and now I get another damage Okay, left or right, we could sacrifice the pack rat, like you said, onto the cockroach. Yeah. Hmm. 
Hmm. The Rattler. Okay. Okay, so the pack rat, like you said, under cockroach. Yes. Even if it deals only one damage, it has. But yeah, it's a bone deck. We had a cockroach with uh, the magnifying glass last time. Now we've got the cockroach with the the items. You came upon the old wood carver who fixed on tense gaze upon you. After another long moment of silence, she moved to offer carvings. Okay, something that is is worth three blood. Oh, we've got the birds, so maybe the cuckoo could leave tails behind. But I think things that are worth three blood would be useful for two cards. Yeah. The grey-haired woman silently collected our carvings and left. Okay. Got any gold in their skull? Let me crack it open and open a and take a look. Open and look. Okay. You're not going anywhere. Ha! <laughs> the, the rabbit leaves a tail. And then we can place the adder in front of it and the pack mule will die. The Alpha. Okay. Okay. Give me cards. You coward! That mule was defenseless! Okay. Well, my wolf pup can kill your wolf pup. I think uh, we we can do this like this and uh, yeah. I mean, the snake's going to die, or I could place the squill there. Play the raven right there, swing to strike and then dodge the attack and leave its thing behind. Nope! There's two! Yeah. There's go to them cards! Yeah.
God, I'm so gold! Yep. And now this is going to block the path to this one. The coyote can kill the wolf. Wow, rabbit pelt. Get him! Well, oh, we've got the war in again. Opossum. Let me see. Sheets of icy snow battered your body as you fought your way up to a vantage point. The snow covered trees jutted from the landscape like prickly misplaced teeth. You continued on through the snow line. Okay, so we can sacrifice something there. Hmm, we could place yeah the goo, the goo. Ah, the goo is to the right. Okay, yeah. I was just checking my things. Yeah. I'm anticipating some extraordinary pelts. Yeah, pals. Well, we've got the magpie, the wolf cub, the black goat, the ant queen. I don't think we really need the black goat right now, but it could be useful later. Pie, cub, and wolf. Pie, cub, and wolf. I will make good use of these. And give us another pack rat. All full, but Thank you. Ah. You're not going anywhere near me. It's alright, it's alright, it's the raven egg I don't mind. Going to deal full damage. It's better than letting the moose buck out. Yeah. Indeed. Hmm. Okay.
Hmm. Yep. Good. Does not matter because I've won. Okay, we've got the warren again. Imagine we could place the warren in a pack rat or on another cuckoo. Teeth on coyote. All right. And we've got the goo. My patience is nearing its limits. Let me paint for you. I will aim for perfection. Okay. Again. I'm guessing we do the cuckoo again. We could go for the cockroach. Cuckoo? Yeah? I will muster all my ability for this one. Ah, exactly the same. What do you think? Good! Now we've got a couple of cuckoos that will give us rabbits. Well, I'm going to stop you. And I'm going to get another item. It's going to kill the raven egg. It's all right, it's all right. pack rat will kill the raven egg then the sparrow will have its turn to be killed later by the pack rat the wolf cub will kill the squirrel increasing the amount of bones in my hand It's not going to matter, really. Okay. After this, I can place 
something more offensive on the board. Oh. The adder would kill things. So the rattler will kill the raven, hurt the one behind. And then I'm going to stop. I'll pass my next turn, yes. I'll pass. Yep, you do that. The cockroach. So, my pack rat will kill you. My rattler will strike the board. It's not going to.